Hey there, Rob Rayner here. Uh, not a terrific property uh, from a condition standpoint that I'm in today. I'm actually in a foreclosure property. Uh, this is an acreage listing that is uh, just outside of Cochrane. Uh, so this house is in foreclosure. And one of the neat things about foreclosure is that a lot of times the property isn't in the greatest of condition. Uh, it's been uh, hard lived in abused and now it's empty. A couple of things about foreclosures. Uh, a lot of people are under the misconception that uh, you're going to get this great bargain off of the list price because it is a foreclosure. Not necessarily the case. Banks these days because of their low carrying costs are willing to sit on a property until they get what they feel is the fair market value for it. Now you might be in a position where the list price of the home is actually under what it would be if it was, you know, fully livable and renovated and clean and acting like a normal home. So they're almost already devalued a little bit. You're not necessarily going to get that extra jump off of the list price that you would expect. The banks, they need to make back what they have invested in it. And foreclosures usually have racked up a bunch of costs, lawyer bills, banking bills, etc. So foreclosures aren't always the deal you think they're gonna be. They could, however, be listed under value when they do go on the market. The other thing to remember on foreclosures is you've got a lot of work to do and there are absolutely no warranties and representations on a property. So you have to really do your due diligence and make sure it's the property for you. Question, do you seek out foreclosures trying to get a deal on a home just because it's a foreclosure? Love to hear your comments on this. Info at robrainer.com. R-E-Y-N-A-R. Info at robrainer.com. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.